Revenge Nicol Bolas. I'll be the first to ad admit that Revenge Nicol Bolas' deck is bullshit. But, um, it is one of the ones that likes to dig through his own deck quite a lot. Um, so in the interest of simply racing, this is a pretty good hand to start with. And I get to go first. Now let's see how many muxes he lays. One. Oh, just one. Brr. G glad to see that in the graveyard, although he does have Rise from the Graves, so if he... Well, then again, I have Mind Control. situation for mana curve pur purposes that is what I do he has melt himself three for me but he also has gotten himself domain It is useless to have both of those out, so I will not spend the mana. Unless he destroys that one. He's not having a pr he's not having a good game himself. Diabolic tutor. That could be an issue. Let's see what I get. Um, that's worth putting out there. Just in case. Although, I will have to remember not to put it on what something that I might control. A second tutor. That makes me very curious what he went to get the first time. Okay. Do I just sand him out? Is that the play? Um, a mox? Okay. Really? This is actually kind of anticlimactic if this is all it takes. Um, yeah, of course, of course. Um, as with before, that's worth putting out. Or maybe even not anymore, maybe I should have just milled three more cards. Okay, yeah. But I might just have everything I need already. Okay. this okay ah what do you have in here Inferno Titan. 
Grave Titan. That'll give me stuff to... That'll give me lots of things to block with. So I think I'll do that. But on the other hand... No, I do Grave Titan. That'll also give me stuff to equip. I think that's the best thing I could have done. Right, right, right. Ah. Uh. Because that'll go back to my hand. I probably should have done that. Before combat, though. But now he only has four left. So I can just... Okay. Don't even need to do that anymore. He's done. That that was that was kind of disappointing though. Oh well. Nicol Bolas revenge down. 